joining me is none other than Sanya Mirza to talk about her glorious career, which is almost coming to an end. Sanya, we discussed this when you joined us at the CNN IBN uh, Indian of the Year Awards last year, a couple of months ago. Uh, since then, you've played your final Grand Slam at the Australian Open. For those who don't know, Sanya actually sent me this T-shirt from the Australian Open. Uh, so I'm wearing this for this very special interaction. Um, you know, we saw your speech uh, after your final match, and it was almost a fairy tale retirement from Grand Slams, where you made it to the finals with in mixed doubles with none other than Rohan Bopanna, one of your oldest uh, friends and uh, partners. And it was a very emotional moment for you. Could you describe to us what that moment was like? Um, well, I think that. I was holding on to so many emotions for those two weeks that everything kind of came out together. And I think it would probably come out anyway at whatever time my Grand Slam was going to be over. But it just yeah. happened to be in front of the whole world and in the final. So, I mean, I'm so glad, right, that happened because if I had to write a story uh, where mm -hmm. I would like to finish my career and where I would like to finish playing, it would be on one of the biggest courts of the world, um, you know, and playing in a big final. So, for me, it was a dream um, finish and it was obviously very special because it was in Australia as well. But uh, for so many reasons, my I mean, my son was there, my parents were there. It was with Rohan, who was my first ever mixed doubles partner 22 years ago, which is crazy when I say those numbers in my head actually now. You know, I, I, you don't realize how, where those 22 years have gone. Time just kind of flew by. And um, yeah, so there was so much in my head and, and that's why I started by saying it's all happy emotions because the emotions were actually really, really happy, satisfied, full of gratitude, gratefulness. It was all that. And and yeah, mm -hmm. a little bit of just sadness to leave and know that I'm never going to come back um, and compete in a Grand Slam final again, you know. So, um, but yeah, mostly it was all happy and I was just holding on and holding in for two weeks. So I kind of uh, just let it all go.